Welcome back to another Real Talk Reaction. This one is for DC's Legends of Tomorrow, Season 3, Episode number 2. Yeah, so the squad is back. They had they defeated um, uh, Hunter's negativity and yeah. douche, doucheness. Um, and they are officially back together. They got yep. their ship, so they can get back to it. Yeah, they're back to traveling, and they're moving on with it. And we don't, we haven't really got an idea of what's going to be the big main plot. We know that uh, Rip knows about somebody that's coming, so that might be the overarching bad guy. Whenever, yeah, whenever, whenever that we makes get appearance. to it. Yeah. yeah. So we'll see, but we're having a lot of fun with it so far with the first episode. So let's get to the second one, and we'll talk more about it on the flip side. Till then, people. Peace. Going to the corner store to get a chocolate covered donut where my mom used to buy them. Tonight's <laughs> breaking news. Vixen caught on camera. This video is rare footage of Vixen, Detroit's own superheroine who has waged a one person war against drug dealers and corrupt cops alike since she first appeared in the city three years ago. That's a really great daughter, right? All right, I got one of my mom's favorites. Yeah, chocolate donuts, crumb cake. Hello? Am I? Hello? What, she just Hello. left? She didn't even tell Anybody me home? Yes. Oh, fly. It'll return to normal size in 24 hours. Or if you don't want to wait. Oh, you are on fire, dude. All right. Let's gather the rest of the team and check out the new anachronism map. We really missed that time. <laughs> what, you afraid of clowns? No, I just don't like their stupid faces and funny shoes and razor sharp teeth. <laughs> All right, guys, if you were an anachronism hiding in the circus, where would you be? How about him there? Oh, you let's go? No way. No way, indeed. They covered up in flour to make it look old. Bingo. Gentlemen, may I present to you the saber tooth tiger. Did I mention that I am allergic to cats? Please tell me you brought your shrink ray. <laughs> they made it bigger. Oh, no. Okay. Wow, he's really cool. Okay. I heard a roar. Looks like our problem got all up here. Okay. Let me get this straight. You three released a giant saber-toothed tiger. Release isn't the word I'd use. Yeah, more like, uh, they didn't contain. No, she was actually here. that thing. Is this much important to you now? Hey, girl. Oh, hey, girl. How about one final mission? For old time's sake. Oh, you know he cares about his DNA. Yeah, but we're fine without you. Everything's running smoothly. Is that right? Bigger than the extinct tiger. Which Amaya and I are going to catch. And then I have to return to Zambezi. We're going to need your shrink ray, Ray. Cool. This is super cool. First, Amaya goes on me on my birthday. No heads up. And then she shows back up on the ship again. No heads up. Bro, she's from 1942. Did you really think that was gonna work? No, 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 you were happy. Hey, 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 hey! You know the lady. Oh, you know, oh, yeah. That's man. not a lady. That's a freak. Are you trying to pick a fight with me? <laughs> because I would love to get into a fight right now. This is like the scary and yes man, babe. Time for us 
to be healed. No, no, go away. We just met. Please. Are you going to tell me? Where did you learn a humbug like that? Well, that's no humbug. Can you say the tea? See, people like us, we got to stick together. And by the way, your beard is beautiful. You're so sweet. <laughs> It's a little cute, cute baby kitten cat. It's kind of cute. <laughs> well, I'm glad Nate finally took our advice and went to talk to Maya. Uh, true, but man, he is about to miss out. <laughs> oh, they're going to get kidnapped. We just might save the circus yet. Water? Are you giving me water? Wow, 
Yeah, I'll be so good. We're going to give you the time bureau. Good news, neither really the team. Well, both of you are pretty good, though. I could use some water. Yeah. <laughs> Legs crossing out. I hope that thing's potty trained. Probably not. I guess it jerks. Let me guess, you're a dog person. I like them dumb and loyal. Speaking of, we should probably check on Gary. has reached a level nine. Oh, that's a... Oh, no. <laughs> you just gotta get over there and then clap your hand, though. You're a son of a gun, it worked. Oh, you really are quite marvelous. One more. Oh, come on. One more. Like, why haven't you been doing this the whole time? Why she <laughs> there we go. Guys, a mile looks like she's gonna kill him. Wow, wow she just goes oh. all in. Wow, oh. she's like possessed. So she can't stop it. of America. It's the most crazy person I know. That totem makes you a protector, not a killer. Two places of wonder. Mm. I mean, I don't believe that the anachronism has been dealt with. Believe it, Agent Sharp. As I've already it. communicated to Director Bennett, 1870 Wisconsin is anachronism free. Oh, even our AI doesn't like you. Yeah, <laughs> my foot is definitely asleep. Gary. And my leg. Yeah, my foot definitely Could be asleep. permanent. Oh, ew, who is this guy? That's Gary. Can you give him a That's hand? Gary. <laughs> I need to speak with you in private. You said that Rip will finally give up his ridiculous belief that your team could actually, and then you stopped yourself. So let's have it. Who are we facing? That information is need to know. And all you need to know is that you and your ridiculous team could never handle it. Hater, aren't you forgetting something? Gary? Gary. When they tried to run, I hunted them down, one by one by one, and I ripped them to shreds. Mm. That's the real reason you came back. I needed a place to think. This, this totem is my birthright and my sacred duty. Something's terribly wrong. What if I lose control around my village? I'm sorry, I... I wanted to tell you, all of you, but I was too ashamed. Come on, girl. You are one of us. Right. Maybe now more than ever. We'd be crazy to let you go. Uh, yeah, I know you would. 
Besides, I really so need your help. So are we boyfriend and girlfriend again? Yeah. We have a new problem. Rick has been hiding something from us. There's a greater evil coming. Something even the Time Bureau is afraid of. <laughs> what can be worse than an immortal Egyptian demigod? Or an evil speedster? <laughs> oh, I'm afraid of the time boogeyman. The time boogeyman guy. All right. episode two of legends of tomorrow and man i thought it was all right i mean i i, I thought it was all right not better than the first one um I but the it... last the last bit um when they got into like what's gonna be happening in the season interesting yeah i thought um um i did like the fact that they brought amaya back i like the fact that they totally explained why she left and yep. it has a legitimate reason it didn't sound cheesy whatsoever i thought right. it was really cool that she went and checked out her granddaughter uh vixen you in know detroit, in detroit yeah. i thought that was a great play too i wish they would have done like a, we got to see the news channel but i wish they would have actually shown like her like looking at her saving yeah, something like yeah. a little like visual yeah. would have been really cool um and it's interesting too that now her powers are like out of her control. Out of control. So yeah. I'm wondering, like, is like, is this having to do with all the time stuff that? That's happened? what I was gonna say, like, cause because if that's the case, then wasn't that supposed to happen in the 40s anyway? If that was gonna happen, or like you said, yeah, is that because she's been doing all the time jumping in now? And then the other thing I was thinking, like, crazy. with your line of thought, was like, was this something that was supposed to happen? And I was thinking maybe her attacking, like, and completely, like, dismembering these Belgium soldiers is mm. what ultimately leads to her um, village getting completely raided right. and, like, attacked. Well, yeah, yeah, so, yeah. Um, she could, she could it, have been a cause of that. Yeah, yeah. It's, like, it, it'll be interesting because we don't really know. Yeah. But, um, so but it's I'm great. glad to see she's back. Now. Yeah, me too. So. I think that she's a great, gonna, great acid, part of the yeah. team. It's a, great, it. it's a great power. Obviously, she's going to be intimidated about tapping into that power, so that would be interesting on yeah. that too. Place. Have to but that out. the end of the episode was seeing the villains. At first, I was like, when the person with the robe, I was like, and he's she started doing. I was like, is this like a female Merlin? Which I don't know. Yeah. I don't know any of the characters and villains, yeah. but like that's the first thing I thought of. And now we have like um, the water, like coming out of the water, yeah. felt very Merlin to have, me as well. Yeah, I have no clue of at how all. Powerful who, this I don't even know who these two people yeah. are, but I love the crap out of it that it's two females is yeah. what we say and they're the villains yeah. for this episode yep. or for the season like that's awesome like i love yeah, it yeah so i'm definitely interested to see what these powers are why people are so scared of them and, and you know who, the who are they yeah, and they definitely are. comment and let us know like i'm sure you guys know you guys always know everything you guys uh fill us in we obviously don't know, but I'm super intrigued, and I can't wait to find out more. I love, like, love that we have, like, female villain. Like, yeah, yeah, awesome. yeah, yeah. And the diversity pick they picked for that, too. Yes, absolutely. Villain. Totally threw me off right there, but I'm glad to see that. It's just, it it seems like it's going to be interesting. This All I got to say is this villain better be badass because they just got through cracking up about... You right, they, reverse they, they, flash, they, they, Egyptian uh, god, whatever, right, right, right. and time, whatever. This, this gotta be. I mean, and they're totally badass. justified to be like, look at all the shit we already been yeah. through. Hello, like it can't be that bad. So, so they need yeah. to bring it. You don't have sure. to bring it on that. Yeah. yeah. So let's get it then. Well, I, I enjoyed the episode. You know, not as much as the first, but I still enjoyed the episode. Yeah, I thought it was. I think it's yep. great for setting up the season and great yeah. for like hyping yeah. yourself up. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, well, look, thank you guys again for watching another Real Talk Reaction for DC's Legends of Tomorrow, Season 3, Episode Number 2. And until next time, people, peace. And we'll drive five in the air. Let's go! I got to be happy locked down. Cause I'm the hardest dude in the club right now. She got to be happy locked down. Cause she the better chick in the club right now. I got to be happy locked down. Cause I'm the baddest chick in the club right now. He got to be happy locked down. Cause he the hardest dude in the club.
right now. Look, I'm on the guest list, walking past these.